This company has said in its own financial statements that it expects to, to earn $200 million in profits from this deal. That is our taxpayers' money going to offshore investors and get worse services than we already have. Well, thank you very much, uh, sisters and brothers. I'm glad that you're doing this. I'm glad that we're here and that we're standing up for public health care once again in this province. This is the largest single privatization of our health care system since Medicare in the province of Alberta. And it is coming in under the watch of this health minister, this unelected health minister, Stephen Mandel. It, it was... It was a decided thing long ago. It came from the Redford government. But the final decision is in that man's hands, Stephen Mandel, and he made the decision to proceed with this privatization to a foreign company, billion dollars of contracts. This company has said in its own financial statements that it expects to, to earn $200 million in profits from this deal. That is our taxpayers' money going to offshore investors and get worse services than we already have. And it's very interesting that the doctors who depend on this, including Dr. Bob, have stood up very hard against this because they know it affects the safety of their patients and their ability to do their job. So we really have to ask the question, why are we going down this path? Why are we going down the same old path that the Tories have always tried to foist on us? Mr. Prentice says that they're under new management. Things are gonna be different. The bad old days of Alice and Redford are behind us. But if you look at this decision, like so many other decisions, you will see that it is the same privatization agenda that the Conservatives have always had. It's important in this by-election that we stand up and send the Conservatives a message. This is an opportunity here in White Mud to send the Tories a message and elect Dr. Bob to stand up in that legislature and tell them what it is, how it is. So I want to thank AUPE and your local and all of the leadership from Guy Down. We've seen tremendous leadership from this union and I really do appreciate the fight that you're putting up. Other unions are here as well in support and I appreciate that very much. What we need right now, what we need right now, sisters and brothers, is solidarity and standing up against the Tory privatization agenda. Thank you very much.